For example, qualifying for $400,000 and losing 17% drops your actual maximum qualifying price to just $325,000. Back in October, the Jets thumped the oil 5-2 in their first of three meetings this season, with Nikolai Ehlers notching a hat trick. I wouldn't mind doing it again. But it's a different Edmonton as of late, coming into tonight winning five of their last six. McDavid. And of course, it's always a spectacle when Connor McDavid's in town. He's a pleasure to play against. Um, he's a challenge, I think, that makes you better as a player. So uh, you know, definitely, look at, definitely always mark my calendar for these games. As for the Jets lineup, both Enstrom and Bufflin remain out this evening. However, head coach Paul Maurice told media this morning that Bufflin is making strides and he hopes to have 33 cleared and in the lineup early in the new year. Ryan Harding, CTV News, Winnipeg. Welcome back inside the kitchen. I'm joined now by Jason Wurtzman, our resident turkey chef here at CTV Morning Live. Thanks so much for being here once again. Today we're talking Greek turkey. What is it that makes turkey Greek? Truly didn't go overseas to get this fella. The Islanders have been a hurdle Winnipeg has struggled to overcome as of late. The Jets have lost five of their last six to New York and heading into tonight's game, the Jets have lost five straight to the Islanders at Bell MTS Place. If the Jets are going to turn the tables tonight against the Islanders, they're going to have to do it, of course, without leading goal scorer Mark Scheifele. He misses game one this evening of that six to eight week timetable. That also means head coach Paul Maurice has been forced to shuffle the lineups just a bit. It also means Sean Mathias draws into the lineup for the first time since December 3rd. 